Good morning, Warrior Crew. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Kat. This is my channel. And today's actually kind of an exciting day, so I thought I would film a, a day in my life. Um, we are preparing for Gulf Shores on Wednesday. Today is Saturday, November 7th. I think um, we just finished decorating the house last night for Christmas. And example right here. Um, <laughs> so you guys said you were super interested in continuing to follow me um, throughout my days and what I eat and what I'm doing post-surgery. So November 7th, we are two months, six days post-op. So um, again, my skin is looking really good. I'm really surprised. Um, I'm getting my hair done and some brow wax, a brow wax. We gotta take out the trash. Super exciting. It is 8.56. My hair appointment is at 10. Um, and I just finished taking my vitamins a half an hour, well, 20 minutes ago. So I've got 10 minutes before I can eat anything. So I am going to clean up a skillet and go ahead and cook one egg. Hey, hi, Rory. Purr, purr. One egg, and then I'm probably gonna measure out my cheese to add to that egg. Just been doing some high V sharp cheddar. Um, this is full fat. I will probably be getting some new stuff when we get back. Um, I wanted to use up what we had before buying new stuff. So I've got full fat, but in the future I'll probably get reduced fat. Not fat free, because I am I am tracking fat. I'm tracking carbs, fat, and protein. But um, none of those have I had an issue with yet. So um, I need to take some protein balls with me in case I get hungry, because my hair appointment lasts about two hours. So... Um, yeah, that's what we got going on. And I'm going to come home and film all the videos that are going to go up while we're out of town. I think it's five videos I have to film today. So, um, and then I need to do some Poshmark stuff maybe. We'll see if I get to that. I might end up doing that tomorrow. We're still waiting on um, a president for this freaking country. So I'm hoping we'll have an answer today. I mean, it's Saturday. The election was Tuesday, I think. The whole country is ready to just throw up and of course in my house my husband and i voted differently so um if you're wondering how that works it's not a fun time right now we just don't really talk about that we agree on the big things like women's rights gay rights uh racial inequalities those kinds of things but um he voted for a different candidate than I did, so. I mean, it doesn't really matter because no matter what, Kansas and Missouri, which is where Kansas City is, and I never really say if I'm in Kansas or Missouri, but Kansas and Missouri are always red states. Um, so one of us always gets our way and one of us doesn't, and I'll just put it like that, so. Um, I am going to get everything ready, cook my egg, and then we will go into the living room, eat our egg, and then I need to put on some moisturizer because I just have a serum on. Um, and then at some point I'm going to have to put pants on. I'll leave it like 930, so mm -hmm. I need to wrap this clip up. All right, I'll catch up with you guys in a minute. Okay, so it is 909. I'm cleared to eat at 910, so I'm going to go sit down. And eat this it was gonna be an over easy egg and then um, the yolk broke on the way in the pan so it turned into unintentional scrambled usually I do my scrambled eggs differently but um, this is what we got Alexa turn on the living room Ta -da! okay can't fluff this up or make it look cute because I don't have enough hands Here's today's outfit though. I've got my waffle coat from Skims. This is a little free people shirt. American Eagle jeans that do not fit anymore. Like this just, these are 14s. I guess I need a 12, Jesus. 
Um, they're really starting to get baggy. Um, and then Tommy Bahama, and then my scrunchie is from Urban. So we are one or two minutes behind. I gotta grab a bottle of water and we need to go. Right, I am here, I am waiting for my stylist to come out. Um, I'm supposed to wait, usually. I don't know if she's not texting me back. I'm supposed to wait until um, they come and unlock the door and let me in. I don't know if that's a thing still. I don't know, the last time I came, I came in the back door, which was, I mean, they don't give a crap, but um, I don't know what to do. I'm waiting for her to text me back. I'm getting my claws done on Tuesday because God knows I need new nails. I look ridiculous. People are staring at me. I'm putting the camera down. All right, party people, we're done. Um, some exciting things happened while I was in there. A, we went for a middle part, which I don't think I've ever done, and we did curtain bangs. I think I cannot get the right angle on my camera right now, um, and I need to do the rest of my makeup. But here's the hair. We just did like overall highlights. That looks really dark right there, but it's not. <laughs> it's just the lighting. I cannot get a good angle here. Um, but I never talk about politics or religion on my channel, um, but we just elected a new president and the first female vice president in our country's history, and it's a big freaking deal. And uh, as I mentioned earlier, Brett and I vote differently, so one of us was going to be happy and one of us is going to be not happy, and the easiest way to put it is that I'm ecstatic. Um, and I know that might offend some people, but it is what it is. Not everybody's going to get their way all the time. I didn't get my way four years ago, and Brett did, and now it's my turn. So um, if you voted, I'm happy you voted. If you didn't, please vote again in four years. Please vote in your primaries. Um, those are equally as important because that um, almost affects you even more because um, it has to do more with your local level stuff. So um, my brows are pink because we did my brows as well, but I am gonna go run some more errands. Um, I definitely just cried under the dryer. Happiest tears, happy tears. Um, <laughs> while I was in there waiting for my bleach to set up, uh, so I definitely need to fix this, but I also don't have any actual face makeup on, so, other than the little bit of concealer I put on, let me see, it is 12.30, so, I'm really trying to, the bang thing is different for me, it might not look different to you guys, but it's different for me, so. We'll figure it out. Um, I think I'm gonna stop and check my P.O. box, which is always linked down below. I think I'm gonna, what I have started to call, go shopping through my own closet to figure out what jeans I have that will fit me. Um, Cause I don't think these fit me the best right now. Um, they're a good option to have, but I don't know if I wanna take them to, I keep saying Florida, We're going to Alabama. We're not going to Florida. Um, but I'm gonna eat my protein ball and head over to my P.O. Okay, so we have an ocean tree and I wanted to get a few more ornaments. <gasps> Look at these, oh my God. And they're all 60% off. They were only 50 last time I looked, so really excited about this. All right, I need two hands for this. the one ornament I want well they had one of the one ornament I wanted but it was broken so I got the five ornaments I needed some navy blue so I got the five the super beaded ones are gonna be perfect um, and I will show you guys that tree when we get back um, I think I'm gonna head back to the house I need to let out the dog she needs to oh wow back lid. okay let's get in the car hold on so I needed navy in the tree, so the beaded ones will be perfect for that. These are so pretty. They've got like the iridescent beads on them. Oh my God, I love these. So they were four bucks each with the discount, um, which I'm pretty happy about. I think probably with my, with my ocean tree, I'll probably get like a few new ornaments for it each year. Um, and then eventually it's gonna outgrow the tree that it's on. 
we'll have to get a bigger tree and I'm not mad about it. Not mad about it. Um, but my thrift store is doing, it's hard to do this at the same time, 50% off clothes today. And I kind of want to go take a peek, but I have got to go let that poor dog out. She's been locked up most of the day. So, um, all right, let's go home. Oh, I didn't eat lunch either. I just had that protein ball. I'm not hungry. This is so weird. Um, I don't know. I'll have to figure that out on the way home. So it'll take me 15 minutes to get home from here. I might even see if there's like another Joams that I could go to. Because it said that they had that, um, that ornament I wanted. And it was probably, it said they had them in stock. But, I mean, how are they supposed to know the only one left is broken? So, okay. I'll catch up Okay, here. quick outfit change before I go to the thrift store. Hi, Coco. Say hi. Um, and I put up the new ornaments. You can see them there. I'm not in love with the placement, but... Um, the little shell is down here, and where did I put the other one? Oh, right here. So I'm gonna do some finessing, tuck this in. I don't love this because it's like right next to this one, but, um, so I just changed my shirt really fast, and I got the most exciting package in the mail, you guys. So I have an upcoming sponsored video, and I'm so excited. I'm just gonna tell you about them even though they're not sponsoring this or anything, but it's a jewelry line. So I got a necklace and two pairs of earrings from this amazing, super sustainable brand. Like they offset their carbon emissions. The jewelry is gold plated. So those of us with crazy sensitive ears can wear them. Like I'm so excited for that video. It's gonna be a haul video that I'm gonna tell you guys about. I have it slotted to come up on the 20th. I don't know when this video is gonna come out because I didn't even plan on filming this. So, um, but I think I'm starting like in this region to look thinner, but um, yeah, I'm so excited about these earrings. They kind of like jingle when I move my head. <laughs> I'm just too excited. Today's just been a really good day and I'm getting used to the bangs. She's a good girl. Okay, we're gonna go to the thrift store and Bath and Body Works. Now. Okay, I think I just saw a line. Yeah, uh, we're gonna go to the thrift store first and come back and then hopefully that line will be on later. Okay, so it is now almost 3.30. I went to two thrift stores. One I got nothing at and the other I got a sweatshirt, a vintage sweatshirt and a couple of t-shirts. Um, one's brand new with tags. One is a vintage tour tee of one of Brett's, actually Brett's favorite singer. So I got him two shirts for Christmas. We're driving and vlogging. This is not good. Um, I'm gonna run back by Bath and Body Works, see if there's a line. Great, glare, love that. Um, if there isn't, I'll go in. If there is, I'll probably come back. I'm pretty tired, I kinda just wanna lay on the couch for a minute, so. All right. Okay, so here's lunch, dinner. I don't know, I'm gonna eat something else later too. This is 170 calories. It is the bonza chickpea pasta and then mushrooms, cheese, and a little bit of like smart balance butter. Okay, so obviously I finished my makeup. It is like 6.30ish. Brett just left for work. Close up of our beautiful wreath. Love it. Um, I am about to pre-film a whole bunch of videos for while I'm gone. I've got the shirts that I'm going to change into. Really, it's like a bunch of jackets and long sleeves and such that I'm going to film in. I've got deodorant. I've got a bottle of water. I've got to turn the TV off. Turn off. I don't know where my cell phone went. That's great. Going to have to find that. <laughs> Hi, Magnolia. Do you want to say hi? She's getting so big. So, um, I'm gonna head upstairs. Oh, the lighting's way better this direction. <laughs> We're gonna head upstairs. Boop. <laughs> Got her tail. Uh, yep. Okay, we're gonna okay, head. Okay. So, real talk here. Um. <laughs> Not sure what order these videos are going out in right now, so I'm not sure if you've seen it yet, but I'm working on the 
haul video, the mini haul that has the jewelry in it. This video is giving me so much grief. Like, I filmed it once, and it, the whole thing was out of focus. That was great. And then I filmed the close-ups, like, two or three times, and they kept being out of focus. Like, they looked like they were in focus, then I went back and they were not in focus, and then... Like, I'm still wearing my makeup and my hair and the jewelry and the shirt I was wearing in the video in case I have to reshoot something again. And I keep editing it and making sure that I'm meeting all the brand guidelines. And, um, like, I really want to get this right because I love this jewelry and I love this brand and I love what they stand for. I want to work with them again. Um, I want more of their pieces, whether I have to buy them or not. And I just... I have spent so much time on this video already and like I have to get it to them as quickly as possible because I'm going out of town and they have to approve it before it goes up and it's going to go up while I'm out of town so if I don't get it to them fast enough and they can't approve it fast enough then I can't make any changes to it and the sponsorship falls through and blah 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 and I'm not getting paid or anything but like if you work with a brand you still have to give your all whether you're being paid or not and I've only been paid for videos like twice. And I think I was only paid, like, the one I was paid the most for was, like, $50. So, and I mean, a brand invested their time and money in me, and that's great. But, like, the jewelry I have is worth, like, $250 almost. And let me, let me do the math. Let me do the math on how much this cost. Okay, so $183. So with tax, it's almost $200 worth of earrings. They've invested a lot of money in me. And I want to get this right. So, but I'm just, like... Like, it's 9.20, and you guys saw me run a thousand errands, and I this is, like, the fifth or sixth video I filmed today, because I'm trying to get so many done before we go out of town, and I want to get it right. And I had dinner, and I didn't even film it, because I'm, like, eating my scallops and crying at the presidential address that just happened, or the, the president-elect and um, vice president-elect speeches. And, uh, people that think being a YouTuber is easy is just like leave <laughs> I don't know like I do enjoy this and I do this for fun so um and there's amazing perks like free jewelry um but you really have to give it your all or brands won't keep working with you so and I have had brands return like Clarins and Payot I have worked with them multiple times and I love their stuff Okay, I've got to finish this because I've got to put this clip in its place and then rewatch it like two more times. And then I've gone over the guidelines and I've met all the guidelines. Then I need to finish it and then. Okay, I'm going to go now. It's done. It's rendering. It's done. It's done. <laughs> or at least I'm done with it. I'm going to send it to the brand tomorrow morning when it hits 100%. Time to go downstairs. I'm taking off this full face of makeup. I'm done. Before I go to bed, I am gonna go ahead and try some clothes on that I bought as gold pieces. Like this little top. See, these pants just don't fit. Like, uh, what are you doing? <laughs> so, um, in preparation for us leaving in four days, I need to see what fits and what can can come with me. Um, and I actually like trying my clothes on when I have a full face of makeup because then I can like see what it will look like. Like, I don't know what it is. It just helps me visualize better. So this is a yes. This is one from Dallas. It came from Altered State. This one fit me then, but it fits better now. For sure. Okay, this is one of the pieces I picked up from Francesca's. It does fit. Um, I don't know. I think I'm gonna put it in the maybe pile. Like it's cute and I do like it and I will wear it. Do I wanna drag it to Gulf Shores? That's the question. I don't know, I might want something more flowy. I feel like I'm gonna end up taking a lot of like tighter stuff. I feel like I'm not going to want something so skin tight. Okay, I think I'm going to put this in the maybe pile. Okay. This is that little top from uh, White House Black Market that I picked up in Dallas. Uh, when I bought it, it wouldn't even go on me, so that's great. It's a size large. Um, 
but it's still kind of tight right here. And I'm not super comfortable in it. Even though I did buy it for this trip, I don't think I'm going to bring it with me. Um, but luckily it is kind of like a fall-ish colors, so I feel like I could wear it later on in the season. Maybe, I don't know, we'll see what happens. This might end up being a top I give to my mom. You know, and she would wear it on the shoulder, which by the way, it does fit on the shoulder. But, um, and it might actually be meant to be worn like this, but it does not. It looks a little Carol Baskin to me, honestly, on the shoulder. <laughs> I don't know why. That's the vibe I get. Coco, do you get those vibes? <laughs> Say, I'm the goodest girl. Wag your tail. <laughs> okay, another basic from Francesca's. Coco really wants to help me with this. Um... Sorry, I've been drinking some protein shake and it's making me a little gassy up front. But, um, this is okay. I mean, it fits. It's still a little bit tight right here and I'm not, like, in love with it, in love with it. I don't know if I want to drag it down there. But I do really like this shirt. I think it's really pretty. I love the embroidery on it. It's that super soft modal material. Yeah, Coco went, eh. My sentiments. Exactly, little one. Eh. Another piece from Dallas. This is uh, the Zara top with the little ruched sides. This is a medium. Um, I'm about 20 pounds lighter than when I bought it when I was in Dallas. And, I mean, it's not squeezing my arms like it used to, which is good. I don't know about this one either. I think this one's gonna go in the maybe pile. It's hard, this is like what I'm saying, like I like my hair and my makeup done so I can see, but like when I have giant drop crotch, it's hard for me to envision this with like a nice outfit. So I, uh, I might have to put the maybes on with like my shorts and see how that looks, but these jeans are ruining everything. I've gotta, I gotta get rid of these jeans. They're horrible. Like, and look at this. this and like, they, they're too big. It's not like my gut is forcing them open. It's, this is like stuck this way from when my gut was forcing them open. Because I think I even wore these. I might have worn these once while I was like super bloated that first week too. <sighs> okay. Next. All right. Another Francesca's top. This one is kind of tight right here. But like I feel like with like my white denim, this could look really cute. I love the super, like, flowy sleeves. Like, with the little... I don't know, I think this one belongs in the maybe pile also. My hair looks so 70s. My mom says this is how she wore her hair when she was in the 70s and 80s. I'm really liking the middle part. I thought I would hate it, but I'm, I'm warming to it. I don't know, the more I look at this, the more I'm not sure. The colors are off in the viewfinder from what they are in person. They're much lighter, less yellowy in person. It's it's the light up there. It's super yellow. Although it is making me look tanner, which I appreciate. Okay, so this was like a dream piece of mine. Um, it is coming up really hot pink and it's really more coral. This is a For Love and Lemons top that I got from Victoria's Secret on super clearance. And it's like a little sweatered like a sweater knit crop and I bought this before my surgery when I was at my top number and it went on then so I knew it would go on now but it fits so much better um this is a size large god look at my arms they look so much smaller holy crap I think I've lost two inches in each arm something like that oh there's a magnolia who's eating out of a bowl that's not hers just kidding they were both eating out of bowls that aren't theirs um, but I really like this top. It's so soft. It's so comfortable. If anything, I think it is super cute with this, like, really dainty jewelry. I think I'm going to take this, if anything, just to, like, take a picture. <laughs> Look, I have hated taking photos of myself for the last, like, six, nine months, somewhere in there. And the fact that I want to put clothes on, like, cute clothes on and take photos of myself is a big freaking deal. So, and by the time I get 
to putting this on, I could even have lost like three to five more pounds, depending on when I would wear it next week. So, <sighs> yeah, I like this. It's so comfortable, you guys. I've got to get more for Love and Lemon stuff, but it's so expensive. Uh. uh. I like the sleeves. Um, I mean, it fits, but like, it doesn't fit great right here. And it's super sheer, as you can see. You can clearly see, like, where my pants are. Um, and I mean, maybe this would be a candidate for... Nope, see, that looks weird with, like, the... This is maybe a give-to-my-mom candidate. I don't know. Maybe I need to, like, weight 20 more pounds and see how I feel about it. Um, I'm going to use my Caudalie Venusaurus cream, my SOS Hydrating Cream. They also sponsored me and sent this to me. And it's almost done. And I need to use it up. I'm trying to use up all my products because um, I realized how much skincare I have and I need to use it. Um, so I did use the Double Serum, the Clarins Double Serum that I just talked about, but um, I'm gonna use this. And then I'm playing my favorite game on my iPad, which is Tap Tap Fish. It's relaxing, okay? I like it. My camera is having some serious issues focusing tonight. Um, so I'm just playing this and I'm watching YouTube. I'm watching Mia Mables right now, for those of you wondering what I watch. Um, and then I'm gonna jump on my laptop. This is my new laptop. I'm really excited about it. I got it for work, but of course, um, I use it for everything. And I'm gonna create an account with Ana Luisa and start favoriting some things because they just had a new drop. They dropped stuff that was not available when I made my like sponsored order. So I have to wait 30 minutes before I can eat something because I just took a, my last pill of the day. And what time was it when I took that pill? It was 10.30. It's 10.45. I've got 15 minutes and then I'm going to eat some salmon because I need to eat that. I'm trying to eat things out of the fridge. Um, eat things that need to go before we go. So that's what I'm doing. All right, snack time. We have, there, we have salt flying everywhere. I have 30 grams of smoked salmon, which is what I have left, one wedge of laughing cow cheese, and it is topped with everything but the bagel seasoning. It's kind of like a bagels and lox kind of a situation. Salmon and lox, whatever, you know what I mean. Um, minus the bagel and, I do have cream cheese, but I'm just using these instead because they need to go. So I'm going to eat this and then I'm going to drink the rest of my protein lemonade and then I think I'm just going to go to bed. I'm actually really tired. Today was a long day. It is like 11.20. So, um, and I know a lot of people are going to be concerned that I'm eating this late, uh, but my dietitian says calories count the same no matter what time you eat them so um, I'm still up I'm still moving and my body still needs more protein for today so I'm gonna take this down and still have to put this on um, but I hope you guys enjoyed this day in my life definitely an interesting day today um, a really good day a really really good day so um, subscribe if you have not already become a Warrior Crew member, let me know what kind of videos you guys want to see in the comments below. And I will catch you in the next one. Love you, Warrior Crew. Bye.